Right, hello everybody, welcome to Season 47, first round match between Tempest Soul and his High Elves, and Leet, I guess we can call him, and his Kenry, and boy how do we start with a blitz, what a way to start. Um, in the booth with me is Skrull Dude and Daedle Kvist, is it Kvist or Quist? Kvist. Kvist. Kvist in Swedish, yeah. Oh, it is Kvist. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, because I've heard some people say it, and I thought, are they are they right? Am I a moron? <laughs> no, but in in English it would be dead. Oh, okay. Right. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Howdy. Uh, so yeah, that, that's a fun and All interactive right. kickoff result, isn't it? GG. Got a love flip. <laughs> yep. Call, Just call uh... again. Short kick blitz versus Camry. Yep. Best elves. Yep. Of course, Leet could have set up correctly, um, had he watched yep. my non-existent setup video that uh, Chunter should have also watched, but it didn't exist, and so they both got fucked. Yeah, I hate the setup, so... Yeah. yeah, terrible. This is exactly... This is a good showcase. You could use this when you make the, uh, the video. <laughs> yeah. This one and the Chunter one, because they do the exact same thing. Yeah, and they're both good players, right? They're both yeah. good players, but... Yeah. They're, they're playing. Probably they're playing would go elves. So far as to say, yes, they're very good players. Yeah, and they're, they're playing elves that completely wreck you if they get a blitz, and you've yeah. just set up in a situation where they can completely wreck you with a blitz. Not sure. Mm. I'm trying to figure out who needs. Yeah. I feel like you should have freed up one more player from that LOS with the blitz, but maybe you need a blitz to the top of the cage here somehow instead. But I kind of want this tomb guarding with break tackle. Doing a bit more than what it's do moving somewhere here. It's so happened twice on the this right challenge. To get in front. Lead. It's happened twice this challenge. And yes, perfect kick, and but you can still set up against it, right? Like, what else have you got to do? Yeah. I mean, I also like it that it took the game <laughs> less than a turn. It was the literal kickoff to just highlight my point. Yeah. What I would have had a fucking best, set, best set of dice in the game. Yeah. <laughs> But I would have literally had a Tomb Guardian there, so it's not that Where hard to defend. Guardian, where is the Tomb Guardian going? Why is he going up the field? What? Well, well, I'll tell is you what, Lee, you can watch my video when it comes out. <laughs> no, maybe not that square in particular. You can defend you can that square. Definitely, definitely make that square defend more defended than it was now. Yeah. And make it so that you can maybe put some pressure on them instead of giving them a duck and a drive. I like I literally did it. I literally did it the same day as the as the blitz happened to Chunter. I literally did the same day I defended properly against it and, and I would have defended that square had there been a blitz, but there wasn't one. <laughs> I literally did the literal same day. He raided into me and I said, Oh look Chunter, this is what you should have done. <laughs> it was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> He'd already gone AFK though, because you know he wasn't very happy about losing. Understandably, and also sorry for uh, sounding like a dick. I did not intend to do that. It's shit for you. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's obviously hor it's horribly unlucky, but you know still could have still could have settled better against the Blitz. You obviously yeah, it's just um, you might have gotten fucked anyway. Yeah, exactly. It's, but it's a Blitz. And it means you're less good if you don't get blitzed, right? Like that's the thing, isn't it? That's the trade-off. Yeah. yeah, you're better if you if you get blitzed, but you're not immune to it. And like you know, you don't you don't shut off blitz being effective. You just protect as protected as you can be against it. Just depends how bad you think the matchup is, right? And stuff like that. Interesting blitz. Out of blitz with a tackle pummel. I guess we're really afraid of the scoring threat, but yeah, I feel like. Yeah. It's a positional blitz, I suppose, as opposed to a tackle one, but I kind of would want to save that dirty player to... I guess we already have one for fouling, but I do want to be fouling, I think, as Kimry, because we're trying to get players down, because stopping an 11 and elf score seems miserable. You've got to stop the elf score or you've lost, so... Unfortunately, yeah. <laughs> unfortunately, seeing as he's got two offensive drives, thanks to Blitz, <laughs> if you don't stop him here, you've literally just already lost. I still think I would have liked to maybe foul that dirty player on the middle lineman to try and get some numbers. I don't know how you're going to stop this team with on a level. He's got a bribe. 11. He's got a bribe, so he should have fouled. At the end, I didn't see okay. that. Yeah, he's got a yeah. bribe, but they oh, all right. yeah. absolutely foul that with a bribe. Yeah, you got to get a couple off. Even though God, he's a data, bro. he's a huge ass bench. Never, man. That's yeah. You're, it's, well, then all you're getting is drive equity, but still, it's 
probably worth it. Yeah, it means you're marking him there and you've got to bribe your fouling him. Like it's mm -hmm. it's a non non decision right at that point. Yeah, even even at two is assist foul, like I just take it. Yep. Like that I roll, take uh... without that I take without a bribe on a, on a better player. Just a roll of six. Killed him. Region, huge. Oh, we went to Ngorian down. Nice. Mm. The, the game wasn't hard enough on me as it was. <laughs> he at least got the region, but He's got a surf. Guardian's being terrible. Yeah, he gets the surf, I suppose. Surprised he didn't re roll it, but yeah, you have to take the surf now. Okay, we're gonna do it in the way that lets us um, get free hits. That's fair enough, I guess. Using the Tomb Guardian, but are we leaving the Tomb Guardians now, like so out of the play? But I guess you don't think the elves are gonna force the score up, but I feel like you're kind of letting the elves take the right side now. I didn't really like that, to be honest. But it's good enough. It's... yeah, I've seen that many a time, Chief Azar and Jack. Many a time. Yeah, it's an issue on the boat that one neither have block. This is uh this oh. is very bad over here, isn't it? Like this so this is like yeah, this the, is the, such the a good move over here. Oh god, this is an accidental dodge. Oh no break tackle. <laughs> I saw I saw a, I saw a, 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 a team yeah. guardian dodge and instantly <laughs> just thought misclick, but no fair enough he's got break tackle. He just rolled the one. Could have fouled. Unless you do. Foul, please. Yeah, I think you... Oh, come on. You have to. You're so far behind now. Yeah, I think... Like, it's a shit foul, and you wouldn't do it normally, but... You've got a bribe, and you've... You yeah, just one assist foul. Like, you get that extra guy in there. Like... Oh, wow. Really? Give... Oh, okay. He's really locking down this throw. But what are we doing? <laughs> Are you taking what? the uphill serve? Are you insane? Yes, you are. You're Tempest Soul. That's but Tempest Soul, yeah. Silly question. Of course he was uphill. To be honest, I'd probably consider taking He just stayed there. He just stayed there as well, just to get served. What, you, what the f What a lunatic. Oh. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. What, what masterful bait by Lee. Yeah. Gotta also, player, uh, the team the dice. <laughs> I also really love how much Tempest is just locking down this Camry throw raw. Like, <laughs> that throw raw can't do anything now, I guess. Good. Really accomplishing it. Good lesson. He was, yeah, he was letting down, I'd say he's playing like the AI, but. <laughs> yeah, you got a punch on the left guy uh, if you want it. If you position the Tomb Guardian up and then uh, cancel this last guy with the with the other thrower, I would have preferred that, and then punch the guy on the uh, dice pow. Easy. Or you just one D pow him. I mean, that's yeah. an option too. I'm, I'm done. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You should try that more often, deadly in your play. Yeah. Yeah. I'm so, things I'm work sorry. well for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Now this is looking pretty good, actually. Like, okay, not really. It would be good if it was your defense. It's not looking good for your offense. But, yeah. Uh, if this was defense and the elves had like twelve players and not fourteen. Oh my god! Why are we doing this every turn? <laughs> this time he's learned. He's learned. He's done a cheer for. <laughs> I'll fucking do it again. <laughs> oh, if only, if only your catcher with sprints. Let him stand right next to the blitzer. <laughs> Gets away. You can foul him. Let's foul him. Foul him just to complete. Oh god, he's not gonna foul him though, is he? You have to foul him. Yeah. There's he's no way You kind of have to screen though, him. right? You kind of have to screen. Oh, he's gonna find You have two DPs! You have two oh, DPs! Oh god. 
Counts as in. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Deserved. Something ridiculous. <laughs> what a ridiculous suit. He's tried twice to pill serve, and the result is being two cast catches. <laughs> <laughs> should play the events next half. It's just Dan the tune going next to the line. <laughs> yeah, literally. You should stand for him to see if he notices. Uh, yeah, 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 do with the stun. <laughs> <laughs> amazing. This would be an amazing start to a defense, wouldn't it? It's yeah. just, it still feels miserable. Yeah, but still, being two catchers down actually is really incredible, because they aren't, you can have numbers, but you can't have replacements for those players, really. Yeah. Yeah, but... Wait, how many catchers does he have left? Is that it? Mm -hmm. No, he's one on the bench? Yeah. Is that just a line The no. one holding the ball, is that a line up? Catcher of dodge. That's the thrower. A thrower? Oh, I didn't even know what a thrower looks like. <laughs> yeah, that's a th oh, yeah, he has no thrower. He's no it's catcher. He's a catcher with Rog. One... Rog catcher. Okay. That's... It's not on the field. Alright. Sure. <laughs> I mean, that's that one that uh, once that got served and didn't get hurt. Was he just not on the field? Uh, he, yeah, he must have. They must have been on the field. He must have gotten served without getting hurt. Seven. No, no, no that's. Yeah, yeah, he must have done because there's eleven there. Three, four, five, six, seven left. Was the first, and there's three the first off, serve so didn't do anything. 11. Yeah, yeah, there has to yeah. be eleven, right? The elves might actually have a little bit of trouble scoring now, but yeah. you know, that's what yeah, the next half is for. One thud. <laughs> yeah, the elite's got to get some pressure on now, which is hard, isn't it? Like this is the hardest thing, trying to turn them over as well. Like God, it's hard enough to stop them scoring, and now you've got to try and get forward. One I mean, of these days, the going on the left will be in the play. You're playing for nil nil in uh, overtime and win the toss, right? <laughs> Foul as much as you can on your way there. Mm. Yeah, nil nil, or they have a complete, or they disintegrate within the next three or four yeah. turns, and you can get luck your way into a one zero. That's those are your yeah. two odds at this point, really. Yeah. <laughs> he needs to put. He needs to stick another two. Oh, we can potato with this guy. This blitzer can potato. Uh, I think it would be worth it. No, we're just gonna run backwards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Potato. Might have been worth it. To, might have been worth it to potato. Yeah, Scoring threats. I mean, he can still pass into him, can't he? Next turn. He's really tight away. Doing a GFI so that he doesn't get based, I guess. That seems excessive. Is he a scoring threat now? No. Is he a scoring threat without GFI? Or just getting away from. Yeah, he's in scoring range now. Okay, without, he can score without GFIs now. Alright, that's. I don't think he needed to do the second GFI for that. I don't think he needed to do any, but he did them. It is worth mentioning that he does, that Leak does have a wizard, so I guess there's some value in making sure you can score in one turn to get uh, some yes. in. Yeah, yeah, but he can still, yeah, and I guess if you're going to do them anyway, you might as well do them sooner, or at least split them. Yeah, yeah, that's, I think that's why the second one seemed excessive, because you're going to split them, split them, but yeah. don't, yeah. I, what, what? Yeah. Yeah, you, you, the second one, even if you fail there, you can't score. No, I meant score. the DP, could it not reach back to foul? No, didn't want to foul, I guess. He doesn't seem wanting to foul like this game, really. I'm so far behind. Can I say this one more time, that he's far behind? <laughs> uh, I feel like he's not purposes. hearing me. Yeah, I think be a little bit louder. I don't know, maybe, I mean, I'm probably the rowdy one, right? I love fouling. Uh, I found out. <laughs> but, I mean, I'm terrible at it, but even I would have fouled, like, after the, after the bits and everything. Yeah. yeah. There, there have been a couple oh, of well, this. easy. Perfect right. seven turn store. <laughs> so we win. And it is perfect because he's only got one turn, hasn't he? Um, even if he wasn't coming with it being a defensive yeah. score. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
I mean, he could go eight and give them no chances to score and no LOS hits to try and get but numbers the, even. The but... wizard was there to. Yeah. Him. So, because uh, he set up to score, uh, to counter score. Each. Yeah, and he couldn't really just dodge him around and maybe I don't think there's a way for him to have dodged around and around. Four plus catch, by the way. Sh shut up, Wolfback. Uh, yeah, for casual four plus catch. Yeah. Didn't burn our room. Do you? I I honestly wonder if you should try one turn here instead of just going for blocks because I don't know if removals are enough. Yeah, to... you're not going to score the one turn though, so yeah. just try and make three cars. It's not over. The reason Camry have a throw raw is because they're movement six and not movement five. Everything else is just tax. To not get hit by the throw rock, Phineas. No. It's just a one turn. Just a one turn. Just one turn of the thing. Even so with the ride and it's two turns, you don't need him for you don't need him for two turn defense yeah. against Camry. Yeah. And he's a thrower, so he's not like even going to be fast moving around. Oh, God, he's there. a thrower. Yeah. Fuck me. He'd pass yeah. anyway. Imagine having a fucking thrower. <laughs> Imagine having a disgusting thrower on your team. Ugh. Ugh. Not Ooh, on my that, watch. I, I remember it was like someone was doing SFL teams. They're like, man, I can't figure out how to get like three catchers. I'm like, just replace the thrower for the same price. It's like, oh wait, yeah, they are. I don't. I guess I should never have a thrower. It's like, no, not really. <laughs> they're the same price as the catcher. If you can do three reels, three catchers, two blitzers, just do the throwers. Just not. Good. The suggested starting lineup or whatever that you see is like the the two blitzer, two, one thrower, three catcher, just like or two catcher, just like just make it a third catcher. Don't yeah. have thrower. Oh yeah, you don't start with the thrower, but you buy the thrower. Well, you can start if you want just two rerolls. You can start with the thrower, or you can do. It, but I'd rather have three catchers and well, two blitzers. Well, he tried re -rolls. for the one turn, but uh, it wasn't possible. Okay, maybe it was. Oh my god, is he gonna get the one turn? Surely not. Because, like, the dodges alone are so hard. Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Even if you just get all yeah. the pushes, like, how hard are the fucking dodges? Oh, and he doesn't even have the ball yet, so. He, yeah, it, it, it requires a six. There's gonna be a six plus dodge in here. Like, what are we. After a four plus catch. And a five plus pass. If only it was Blood Bowl 2020, you could have re-rolled that. <laughs> but no, I mean, it was so low odds, I wouldn't have even bothered trying. But it's hilarious to try. It was funny, and you know, he did the he did the pushes correctly. He's uh, practicing for the third World Cup when he plays Dwarves and has to at least make an attempt with it. <laughs> he has dodge on the... No, okay. It's still, it six, it's still a six. It's still a. It's still a six five four. It can one. happen. It can happen. Six five four with just one try. re roll. That's so after getting all of the rolls. Like that's getting all yeah, of the rolls I mean, to get the push. I mean, how, yeah. how 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 big are his chances to to actually turn over a full hell elf team and score? Like not high. They're they're well, pretty the shitty. Is, with the wizard, it's a bit easier. But it is still hard. I guess the debate is whether it's better to have invested the reason the blocks into getting the the chance to get yourself a five plus four plus six five four two two to score. He could have um, pommed two guys. You know, yeah. he could have he, yeah, he, he he made a foul. big gang foul. Another mighty blow hit. Like I think there's just more more value in going for the hits. Honestly. Well, the problem is that he should have fouled eight turns in a row, and he did. <laughs> yes. Yes, there is that as well. There were at least three or four fouls that previous drive that he left on the table, yeah. Yeah. And then, yeah. like, if the numbers are actually starting to thin, then yes, there's a definitely an argument to just, like, getting them lower. But he's going to be up against, like, Close to a full health team, he's not getting this line of scrimmage, so it's gonna be fucked either way. Mm -hmm. I prefer, I prefer going. You're gonna not score every touchdown that you don't try. 
<laughs> yes, but when you've got like, is it worth going for like a one in ten thousand chance? I just yes. don't think. It, so. Yes, if you if you if you are in Chavez and you're going out, if you don't. Uh, no, I don't really don't think so. I think you're much more likely to get three cars, which is going to give you a much better chance. I don't think you're more likely to. Yes, you are, but not by that much. <laughs> I think you're a lot more likely to make three. Yes, you're, you're, yes, you're a lot more likely. And then but you, you should still, I, I still don't hate it. I still don't hate it. I'm not going <laughs> to sit here and you're not going to change my mind. Yeah. I think it's a perfectly reasonable thing to do wow. in this situation. Good. Also, it's way more fun. He's given up a surf. Interesting. Is that is that a Mr. Surf bait? Does Temper Soul know that he's doing this? He even he's even given him the chance to get a Tomb Guardian on, on the sideline. He's not taking it. Out of hundred percent surf here. <laughs> yeah, no, you you have to take surf here. You have to take every play the rules. Surf Guardian on the sideline. That's what I would. Yeah, yeah, that's the best part. The best part is you get your Tomb Guardian on the sideline for another two yeah. another two catcher cars. Yeah, you gotta be getting every free removal you can right now because you can't win this even players. No. You have to get him down a couple players so you can put pressure on. Get the wizard, get lucky and score, and then try and win it in OT. That's yeah. the way here. Like, I, don't I, don't, I don't like that the uh, killer is not in a position to. I also don't. I hate not. Just base him. I hate doing the screen. Base the shit out of that player and make him do a dodge. He doesn't have yeah, dodge yeah, heal. Yeah, base yeah. him up, make him do stuff. Like, yeah. don't give him these free escapes. Yeah. Like, I was joking about it when, like, the elves did it to, like, the throw on earlier, but, like, yeah, you should be doing that to the elves. Control it so they don't get into the assist, letting them hit down your players, make them dodge back, and... Yeah, everything that needs to roll a dice has to roll a dice. You have to force him to fail. Because, in part, because, again, we're playing for the... Are we fouling? He's got Where a dirty player, and it's Tempest Souls, yeah. so, yeah. He liked to have three Bro. dirty player Dark Elves, didn't he? He's definitely found it. Yes, yes, yes. I was, I didn't think he was in rank, I think we'd be re-rolling for the GFI foul, but uh, here we are. Oh yeah, it's Tempest Oh Soul. yeah, it's Tempest Soul. <laughs> You're welcome. This is Tempest Soul. <laughs> I mean, it makes for interesting games to watch, that's for sure. But mm. he's entertaining. Entertaining. The hells have found more than the Kenry who have a bribe, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a bit weird, isn't it? And also the hells who are ahead and might get sent off. <laughs> thus give advantage back to the Kenry that desperately needs it. <laughs> Base the elves! Jesus Christ. I know they have guard, but you have to, like... You're not screening to stop a score. They I mean, he doesn't well. even need to score. They, like, you can't just screen. The elves are like, oh my god. It doesn't... It like, when I played some of the orcs and they were dark elves and I got, like, I was one on and they are like, all right, I'm gonna I'm like, all right, I'm just gonna sit here. But I, yeah. If you just screen, I just sit here. I don't have to do anything. I'm not gonna force my way to score. I'm just gonna take a hit and stand back unless you want to do something. I'm cool to just take the win. Yeah. It's... It... As long as as long as Leaf doesn't advance, he's lost. Yeah. They've got a lot of guard, haven't they? These high elves. They're yeah, pretty. Nice. They're a pretty good high elf team. Yeah. Mm. Guard. It's blodge guard it too. If they have any catchers. Yeah. Yeah. The catchers are okay. They aren't the greatest catchers you'll ever see. They aren't. There's no like agi catchers. There's some good catchers. They're, they're surfed. That's the joke. Uh, yeah. One of them is Move Up Frenzy. It's actually pretty good. Yeah, the Move Up Frenzy one's good. I mean, even if they're in the game, they're like they're okay catchers. They're not like stat free catchers, which you might want. And he has a thrower, so you know. It's a yeah, thrower. and he doesn't have a mighty blow, but he does yeah. have a DP. He can get get things off the field with the guard and DP if he needs to. First action on a nine block. All right, sure.
mean, why? I don't have block on that tomb guardian. You're not gonna have to say 50% this six there. Is it 50%? I thought it was like 30 something to get no, the power one to go. It was a 3D ah. with the. Okay. It's, it was. <laughs> but. Yeah, there it's you go. It's with a 2D, yeah. No, no you ba to base them with the mighty blow. <laughs> you don't. With the you tackle, don't so that you have to roll the 3 plus off of tackle. Yeah, that's 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 really weird, not, not basing with him. Like, I think. A Such a good day. Weird. You put them on the inside, you I mean, put them. It's, it's three turns. Like, the tackler. Should he's be gonna, behind the tomb guardian, himself. so he's closer to the middle and still basing him, and can get a hit towards the sideline, so you can like threaten to surf the next turn too. I mean, it's hard, right? It's hard because you can it's easily so get turned around. Like, it's the hardest thing you can do is defending against elves that can score any time they want. But you've got mm -hmm. to be more proactive than this. Yeah, because it doesn't matter. He's gonna give himself one turn where he's gonna be in range to steal the ball with the wizard, and that turn is gonna come up, and Tempest Soul is just gonna. Be not to have to fu have to not fuck up that one turn so that you can't actually get past him. Like he's and not even in range. Ball. If, if no. it was, let's say it's turn fifteen, he could wizard now. It's like, all right, <laughs> you can't touch the ball. I don't care. No, you, and honestly, meant, like, he's, gonna, he's gonna leave himself one turn where he's actually gonna be in range of picking up the ball. If I were to be um, genuinely critical of Tempest, besides all like the silly stuff he does, which is like wildly aggressive, I don't like that the ball is on the agility five guy right now. Because your opponent's really going to have to use the wizard. It should be on just some random lineum so that he can eat the bolt and you have agility 5 to recover. I mean, they can easily turn you around, uh, which, you know, I mean, I've, I've alluded to, right? This is the hardest thing in Blood Bowl is to defend against elves that can score any time. Like, it doesn't matter if you're Kemri or not. It doesn't matter what it, what team you are. They can easily turn yeah. you around. But you it's have to pressure. You have to give yourself a shot. Like, you just, you just have to at the end of the day. Like, okay, it might... It might go wrong, but you've got to give yourself a shot. If for like no other reason you have you are playing like he's playing for this, like he's playing for overtime. So you just have to make him like use rerolls, nothing else, so you can go into overtime like two two or three two or like one one even, but you can't be doing this like have you having to burn all the rerolls to get even and then your opponent's like, Well, I'm just gonna do nothing. I have to do anything and have now after burn a reroll, have all of their resources so that like if you somehow luck into overtime they they're like three rerolls up versus your zero. Like, you can't have that either. Like, you after turn one, like you had to get lucky to not lose, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, that's it. So you've got to identify oh, yeah. that fact instantly, and you've got to say, okay, some some fail states are going to be not that bad. Uh, you know, are going to have to be accepted, and, like, you know, I've got to take riskier pl things to try and get payoffs and stuff. Like, like fouling every turn, especially with a bribe. Like, um, and I'll just say, like, I'm bad, and I, like, always play badly in OT, so it's not like it's easy. Like, I've never... I never have won a, like, a game that goes to it. Well, no, I've won games that go to OT, but once it goes to OT, I just always lose. So, it's not like it's easy. Like, it's really hard, and it's, in a, it's, and it's already, as Jim said, like, the hardest thing you can do is just turn over elves when they don't have, and they can score whenever they want, which includes not scoring, because they don't have to do anything they don't want to at this point. Yeah. They're just, they can just yeah, screen I'm, you off. And I'm really squash. sorry that I'm coming at you hard. Like, it's just, like, I'm... I'm... I would have played this game very differently, and I, I I can only call what I would have done. I can't call what you're doing because I I can't see your grand plan, right? Um, and I'm sorry if it comes um, comes across as mean or harsh or just uh, what's it called when you don't when when you don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, and the thing is, like this this defending one nil up, totally fine, right? Totally yeah, fine, keeping great, it safe, keeping up. everything in front of you. You know, obviously this guy, this this tackle pommel would have been back here and stuff. And this would have been a totally finely played drive if you won it up. But you've just got to play worse because you're behind. Like, that's yeah. a, the unfortunate reality of, Blood, reality yeah. of Blood Bowl is once you're behind, you have to play worse. Yeah. Or at least take more risk. Which is playing worse. Like, I don't think um, you, the decision, for the most part, when you made decisions and executed the plans, you've executed the plans in a way that's, like, bad. Like, I was, um, I was, like, watching Kenora earlier, and he was just, he had some plays, he was like, I'm gonna try and do this thing, and he just didn't pick the right way to do it. You've picked better ways 
you picked the right way to do what you're trying to do, I just don't think the base choice was correct. And that's hard. It's, like, really hard to get to sometimes. It's just, like, the decision, like, oh, all the things you're doing are right, but, like, situationally it's wrong because the situation is atypical and you're not used to playing that way. It just happens. And you get better at it, it's not... Or you're like me and I just stopped playing, so I never could good. So... Don't take it too... Don't take it like it's some permanent state. Yeah, he might have a shot with the Wiz as well. Yeah, it might might pay off, to be fair. Yeah, Tempest has given him way more space than he needed to here. I don't know why he felt... It's an elf screen, just one spare at a time. You don't need to go all the way back. But he has. No. Alright. Here we go. Telling me there's a chance. This is way better of a chance than they should have gotten. Yeah. Yep. And credit, we're gonna be, to be fair, like this is the, definitely the turn to go for. Not wait until 16, give yourself two turns. Your opponent is left on a chance that's easier than it should have been. Just yeah. go for it right now. Why did he send out a scoring threat? Just to make sure Lee went for the fire, went for the lightning bolt, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> is to remove all doubt whether this was the right play. Level up that player. Like, oh. Shouldn't have rolled a one there. That was that was a real bad decision to roll a one there. Yeah, yeah, really shitty one. Tomb Guardian pickle. Surely the Pro Rock is the range. Range, With the movement seven. No, I didn't see him. No, I meant the other Thora. Well, he has to do a dodge either way, I guess. Yeah. So. I think I'd like that Tomb Guardian. Making sure the lineman can't dodge out? I'm not sure, though. Not sure. It's tricky. Way oh, The Dublé ones. Failing the pickup is definitely better than failing the dodge, though. That's a nice. That's yeah. a scatter that you can live with. Yeah, yep. great scatter in three tackle zones. There's a chance. It's going to be hard to clear up everything for the... Uh... Well, not too hard, right? Like, right now, it's just... Oh, okay, we just won dice pop. All right. Oh, what? He blitzed with the Arch 5. Playing, I uh, thought the Arch 5 was going to lob it. I thought the Arch 5 was going to lob it to this guy. I mean, he's got Raj, Jim. Like, who can get Raj down? No one on this Kimry team, surely. Uh, probably not, to be fair. If you, if you roll some two pluses. <laughs> yeah. Just be Tempest Soul. Nope, he didn't roll two pluses. I could roll some two pluses. Do you blitz with the throw raw? Oh, because my God. you. He triple E. Oh. I mean, it's unlucky, but also it was irrelevant. You've just got a great tackle in, haven't you, Surf? Yeah. Why is that, uh, blitz at all? all right. I would have done uh, that. I would have just opened it with all. it, so I'd definitely have the reroll. I'd just don't see why, why I blocked first. No, why, that's what I meant. Why, why is the block? Yeah. It shouldn't have rolled bad dice. I mean, okay, it was 1 in 27, but there was like there was kind of no need to take the risk, right? It's not, yeah. it's not doing anything. See if yeah. you've... You need your reroll to, you've got to get it 1-1 one, one first. Um, but yeah, there you go. Congratulations, Tempest Soul. Commiserations, Leet. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was, that wasn't exactly as I expected it would um, <laughs> before the game started. Yes, it was Tempest the best dice versus the worst dice. <laughs> this is what yep. Turtle said and, 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 and somewhat lived up to that. Um, yeah, pretty much. But uh, there you go. Thank you very much, Skrull and Daedal. Absolutely glorious. Blitz is a powerful event. Yep. Yeah, and, thanks. Uh, <laughs> and thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.